All right, YouTube, JW Solar USA. This is one of the arrays we just uh, fixed, and two of them. So it's bringing uh, 325. It's way dead cloudy out there. And let me show you the other one. This is the other one. It's bringing about 317, and that was 322. So I'll go up there and show you what we did. The other ones, two are facing the west, the other ones uh, uh, east or whatever. It, it is the location there. Clem is going to tell me. Um, so where are they pointing? It was 319, 314. It's right. And three. look at the other one, 314 as well. So this is the one facing the four that were not um, crisscross. But uh, you guys see exactly what's going on there. Come on, focus, focus. Okay, 309. 309, 311. Two. <clears throat> this is the last array. The panels we just moved. And it's right here. You're producing 280, almost very close to 300. The other ones are running right now, three, 310, 310, both of them. So this is two something. So this is the, the system, folks. Uh, the wiring is all done here. And this is just nice always working here, doing these things, uh, grid tie systems. They're really easy to do. It's not that much. So, high voltage and feed them back to the breakers. The disconnect, disconnects to the DC disconnects and go back to here. This is the thing. If you have the uh, the disconnect, um, disconnect the DC part of it. Like, let me say, disconnect the DC part of this and the AC is on. Any of this inverter is not going to come on at all. So you have to see the DC and AC uh, simultaneously before they work. So the other box is here, folks. All right. The cover is back. I already installed that. This is a bond. So don't worry about all this um, insulation or whatever. It comes out because the roof is not all done. You see that? It's not insulated. So... And this is where we're going to be bringing more uh, power. They have uh, two micro vapor lights here. These are the best. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I don't want them on the solar. I don't want them on the batteries. If we're going through batteries, they still stay on the grid. So we're going to add the array we just dismantled. That array is going to be the array for um, the, uh, the AC. We're still going to keep the grid. So one of these, uh, one of these um, inverters, one of these inverters, um, we're gonna be um, get rid of these inverters. So any one of you guys who are interested on buying these, contact me. Then I can give you a price for these inverters, and you can buy them. Sorry for all the shake. I can sell it back to you. They're just a year old. Like I was saying, this one is installed. I marked it right there. The 8 month, the 13. These are the 8 month, the 15. It's just a day apart. This is just, this. I think this one is just, uh, what? Um, I think it's a month. So, <clears throat> you can look at this. You can see how much power already generated. On this thing is coming up annual power generation so it's coming folks okay it's coming okay 18 that's a uh, 1,108 kilowatt hours. Okay? 
1,808 kilowatt hours. And let's check this one. It's coming. I think this was supposed to be around within the 800 something. This is the array that was uh, on the tilt side. We just moved those panels. And this one will be <clears throat> around the 800 something. If I can remember previously when I made the video. Yeah, 876 kilowatt hours. And this one. You see, 1,232 kilowatt hours. So if we put all this power together, look at that. We just maxed that to 1,000 watts. 1,000 watts just came in. <laughs> we just pushed it over 1,000 watts. It's climbing. Four hundred watt, four something. All right, folks. These are the numbers here. One inverter is eighteen oh eight. The other one is uh, twelve thirty two, and other one is eight hundred and seven. So these are all in kilowatts. One thousand eight hundred and eight kilowatt hours. One thousand two hundred and thirty two kilowatt and 876 kilowatt so it gives you 3900 916 kilowatt hours this system already generated within a year okay this system this is the one that generates the 18 1808 okay the one inside the box this one in the middle one already created 876 kilowatt hours and this one here already generated 1232, 1,232 kilowatt hours. So you put it together, it gives you 3,916 3, kilowatt hours total, this system generated. And this system <coughs> is um, um, eight, eight, um, 320 watt solar modules. Eight of them, eight, I'm mean, sorry, 12, 12, 320 watt kilowatt, 320 watt solar panels, okay? Let's see. So, it gives you a total of 3,000, 3,870, something like that. So 320 times 12, do the math. Because I'm not thinking right now, I'm tired, I just got up from that roof. So it's supposed to be 3,870 approximately. So this, this is what the system uh, uh, produced. This system is in a barn, okay? You don't have to be all that fancy, all condo, this, all that, it's in a barn. So this is a system, you, you guys have seen the system before. So this is the power we already generated in this system. JW Solar USA, please subscribe, like, and share. Right from St. Croix Trail with Clam System. Bye for now.